Hey, this is Luke with Saltstrong. In this video, we're gonna talk about cast net size for catching smaller bait. We're talking about pilchards or pinfish in shallow water. This question came up, and uh, now that we're getting close to spring, this is the perfect time to be ready for it. And so the, the, the most important thing to think about is the mesh size. So come in here close, and this is very important because if you have the mesh size, too big, you're going to be, it's called Christmas tree, where those bait fish will get stuck in the mesh, and it is a huge mess, it's a huge hassle, that's something that I, I just, I just thought was, was a thing when you use cast nets for many years. What I was doing wrong is I had mesh that was just too big, so 3 8 inch is the most common mesh, but if you're going to be targeting these smaller bait fish, especially in the spring, I highly recommend quarter inch mesh. This is a smaller mesh, now this is what I use like 90% of the time. Not as many places carry it is the tough thing, but but once I started using this, my days of having Christmas trees of, of just a ton of bait fish stuck in the net are over. And again, it's just a huge hassle. Most importantly, now I can go out, even if the bait fish are small, I can still make a cast over them and not have the risk of, of spending a ton of time getting these bait fish out. So, so mesh is the most important thing. And once I started using this smaller mesh, now I, I use this net anytime I'm casting really in five feet of water or less. The only time I go up to the bigger mesh is when I'm going after the bigger bait fish in deeper water. So this is really the net that I use most of all. So mesh is the most important. Again, quarter inch is better in my opinion than three eighths. And if you have any feedback otherwise, you know, please leave a comment down below. I won't be offended. I do mostly artificial lures, um, but that's just what I found with my own personal live bait fishing. As far as the size, what I like is an eight footer. So this is my favorite net. And this is an eight foot net with one quarter inch mesh. So that has been my, my overall favorite just for ease of use and, and being effective in the shallow water. And the 10 foot net with the three eighths inch is what I use really for pinfish in like the, you know, say four to, to six feet of water. And then I have a 12 foot net that I go after the, the you know, the, I guess more on the reefs and, and around the, the deeper channel markers. But overall, right, the question came in about the shallow water nets for smaller bait fish, this by far, has been my absolute favorite. And as far as brands go, there are a lot of great brands out there. My personal favorite now is this one from, uh, from Black Pearl. They have a unique feature that I believe they even patented, but basically these weights are covered with, uh, with mesh, so it's very quiet. And so like, you know, banging on the boat, when you're uh, in, between, in between casts and you're reloading and, and those, those weights are hitting the boat, that scares the fish off. A lot of these bait fish are, are basically used to getting targeted. And so what this does, what this does, it just, it just deadens the noise, which has been really cool. And it decreases the odds that the net's gonna get tangled. So in this net, this is over two years old and it's been sitting in the boat for most of that time. So it's in, so it's in really good shape. They use, they, they use really, good, really good quality lines. So, so far, these Black Pearl nets have been my favorite, but again, we're not sponsored by them by any means. So if you have any personal favorites that you, uh, that you like, that you've tested out, please leave your feedback down below. We'd love to hear from you. And if you're in need of a net, we actually did just add these to our store at fishdrawing.com. And so Insider Club members, you can actually get 20% off of these, uh, of these really good nets. So that's it for now. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Otherwise, hope to see you again soon.